Oh, there's a quest here. Hello? Please, can you help me? My brother. Cheer up. Don't worry. Helping people and killing people are what I'm best at. <laughs> uh, I, I uh, hope there will be no call to kill anyone, Sarah. Karen uh. was always so devout, so idealistic. He was so proud when the Templars accepted him. I pleaded with him not to join the Order, but he wouldn't listen. You hear dark rumors about the Templars and Knight Commander Meredith. And now my brother is gone. Tell me about Meredith. What do people say about Knight Commander Meredith? Oh, she has many admirers. They lord at the service she does in keeping the mages in check. But others say she is terribly fierce and utterly without pity that she sees demons everywhere. It is dangerous even to whisper such things. Cool. I like danger. What rumors? What have you heard about the Templars? People harboring escaped mages just disappear. Templars interrogate and threaten passers-by. My friend has a cousin who's a mage, and she says he was made tranquil against his will. You hear more with every passing day. What are you saying? So, you think the Templars... what? Killed and ate your brother? <laughs> Maker forbid. I don't know what happened. He just stopped writing me. I tried to see him, but Knight Commander Meredith threw me out. They won't tell me anything. How can I help? Your brother may indeed be in trouble. What can I do for you? Perchance, in your journeys, if you find yourself in the gallows, ask the other recruits, Wilmard and Hugh, about my brother. They were Karen's closest friends in the Order. If anyone knows where he is, it's them. Make her bless you and watch after you in this endeavor. Cool. New quest, enemies among us. <gasps> A backpack! Mine. That's mine. Templar recruit heal? Hey, you know man. a recruit named Karen. His sister is looking for him. We cannot speak to you, Messer. To the void with that. Karen and the others are missing. But our orders! The knights aren't doing anything to find them. Maybe it's time to ask for outside help. Okay. There are others missing? I wasn't even certain Karen was missing. Who else is gone? The first ones disappeared weeks ago. There's been at least half a dozen. Wilmer and Karen were the most recent. Okay. Why do you keep... Oh, wait. Okay. Why do you have to keep quiet? Why must you keep silent about Karen? You obviously aren't a Templar, Messer. A Knight Lieutenant gives you an order, and you obey, without question. They told us not to breathe a word about Karen and the others. They must have their reasons. And that'll be a great comfort if you go missing next. You've come this far. You're already defying orders to talk to me. Might as well share the good stuff. I hear that Knight Commander Meredith has some new initiation you have to go through. If you're not strong enough, or fervent enough in belief, you don't make it out alive. And you honestly believe that? Recruits keep going missing. Wilmot came back. What? He did. I saw him this morning. Tell me about the initiation. What else do you know about the initiation? You hear about some... <laughs> questionable things that the Order must do these days. The Knight Commander only wants Templars that can do... What must be done? Andraste alive. She's killing recruits that might question her orders, isn't she? That's rubbish. She wouldn't do that. Can I talk to women? If Wilmot came back, he might know more about the other missing recruits. I bet he would. Wilmot told me he was going outside Kirkwall. Clear his head, he said. Why didn't you tell us this? Knight Captain Cullen ordered it. Right before he chased after Wilmot. That wasn't too long ago. If you hurry, you may catch them on the road. Okay. Hey, got three gold. Oh yeah, that's because I completed the quest. Duh. Let's see, duty. I don't know what duty is, so... An herbalist task? I, don't, I can't even do that. I can't. There, there's literally nothing there. Women's camp. Okay. Got to leave area. So I take it if we go this way, we'll find something cool. Right? <gasps> Corpse! Oh, with a ring on it! Cool, mine. 
Maybe it's valuable. Oh, ho, a pile of bones. Maybe it also has a ring. And it has four silver. Money is money, I guess. So we got this way to the forward, which leads me to a corpse with an opal fragment. Nice. I'm so glad that you guys are thinking about and my trust they be my witness, Wilmot. I will have the truth from you now. Mercy, sir. Mercy. Were it that easy? Don't hit me. I will know where you're going, and I will know now. So you torture recruits now? I thought Templars only treated mages this badly. Nice to see you're branching out. This is Templar business, stranger. <laughs> You have struck me the last time, you pathetic human! To me! Make her preserve us! To And, uh... You wanna explain that one, mister? Work and stern come out. We got demons to chew on. Yeah, get him with the coat. Oh yeah, look at that frost damage on him. Get out of here. Oh wait, she needs to heal. Phew. I knew. I knew he was involved in something sinister. But this... Is it even possible? Was he an abomination? Do you think he was possessed? Normally, we only worry that mages will fall victim to possession. I have heard of blood mages or demons in solid form who could summon others into unwilling hosts. I had not thought one of our own would be susceptible. Seen one demon, seen them all? With what I've bumped into in Kirkwall, nothing surprises me anymore. I am Knight Captain Cullen. I thank you for your assistance. I've been conducting an investigation of some of our recruits who have gone missing. Wilmard was the first to return. I had hoped to confront him quietly, out of sight. Uh, why did you attack Wilmond? If you didn't know he was possessed, why draw your sword on a recruit? He'd only been back a few days when he left again secretly. It set off some warning bells. I meant to scare him into a confession. He had to believe my threats were genuine. Well, I mean... So there's no ritual? The recruits believed that Meredith was conducting some sort of deadly ritual. What? <laughs> That's preposterous. Recruits can be worse than a weaving circle with their rumors. There is a vigil before Templars take their arms, but the gravest danger they face is falling asleep. What do you think happened? Do you know what happened to Wilmot while he was gone? Obviously more than I had anticipated. Wilmot has never been fully convinced of the Order's rules. Mages cannot be our friends. They must always be watched. I thought Wilmot might be meeting with some old friends who'd escaped the Circle. Not all mages are bad. I've got friends who are mages. Are you saying they need to always be watched as well? I was at the Circle Tower in Ferelden during the Blight. I saw firsthand how Templars' trust and leniency can be rewarded. I still have nightmares of Aldred's depravities. Let's hunt some demons. Where there's one demon, there's usually more. Where do we start digging? I fear it is time to widen this investigation. My discretion may have cost me one of our best recruits, Wilmot's friend Karen. They were last seen together at the Blooming Rose. But I had no Why luck is everyone in going to the brothel? The, uh, young ladies there. I doubt they know anything of magic or demons. The brothel, huh? I'd be willing to search there. The Order would truly be in your debt if you helped us with this. No one at the brothel will speak with me for fear I would shut them down for serving our recruits. If you learn what manner of creature did this to Wilmot, please come tell me in the gallows. I will ensure you are rewarded. Cool. So he had 13 silver on him. This guy died broke. 
Ooh, a rune of impact? Don't mind if I do. I will gladly take it all. Leave area. Alright, um... High town, enemies among us. Oh, we gotta go at night. Of course we do. And, of course, we're gonna have to go over to the brothel for... A, a, an investigation. Mm-hmm. Yep, an investigation. Very important. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. It's... It's... It's very important, this investigation in the brothel that we have to go to to investigate thoroughly. I, I do very vigorous investigations, you see. I'm very happy for my investigations. It's part of the job. Yep. Mm-hmm. That's all it is. I'm very devoted to my job, you see. Hey, Vivica. Do you need something, honey? Are you one of the girls? You don't work here, do you? With the customers. You're no prize yourself, sweetheart. Is there something you want? Don't call me that. Okay. Do you know a Wilman, Karen? A couple of Templar recruits went missing. They were last seen here. You'll have to be more specific. We do a lot of business with the Templars. <laughs> uh, I'll make it worth your while. Perhaps a few coins can loosen your lips. Are you trying to bribe me? You know, not all the girls here are for sale. I'm going to pretend that didn't happen. People's lives are at stake. We have a lot of missing Templars. If we don't act quickly, we may only find corpses. Now, now, no need to get all dramatic on me. Let me look through the books. Wilmud, Karen... Here we go. Wilmud came in here a lot. You sure he had time to be a Templar? The both of them last saw... Iduna, the exotic wonder from the east. Oh my, <laughs> the exotic wonder? That's quite the stage name. It sounds better than the tramp from Darktown. You should hear what some of the others are called. I'd love to know, actually. Do you know anything else? Is there anything else you can tell me? Honey, I could write volumes on the things I know. Unless you want Wilmud's favorite position, I think you have what you need. You didn't hear any of this from me. We clear? Why is this guy staring at me? Wait a minute, is that Mirren? And waiting for you upstairs. Mirren! Many thanks, Madam Z. Um Why is he here? No, for real, why is he here? Is it over here? No. It's okay, so it's in the door that oh. Hi. My crafting recipe acquired, Rune of Lightning, but I didn't see anything in there. Weird. Out of my way. Out of my way. I don't want all these beautiful ladies to swarm me as they normally do. Alright, what do we got? You must be the exotic wonder of the East. Do you remember entertaining a Templar named Wilmud a few weeks ago? Or Karen? Wilmud. Wilmud. That doesn't sound familiar. Drop the act. Do your clients like this charade? It must get dreadfully tiresome. Wh wh whatever do you mean? <sighs> Questions are boring. Why don't we have some real fun? Are you certain we can't postpone this, Hawk? You should listen to your friend. What's wrong with you? We have to ask her about Karen. What's your problem? You really can be quite a bore. You know that, right? No. You really are... S you really are persistent. As charming and relentless as you are, I'm here to investigate. Answer one of my questions first. Who told you about little old me? I'm asking the questions here. It was Vivica. She showed me her books. That wasn't so hard, was it? So Vivica sold me out, did she? That drab, pathetic little sewer rat. She will be dealt with. 
just do one more thing for me. Draw your blade and bring it gently across your throat. You can't control me. I will not be toyed with. How did you... Oh, shit. Spare me, Messer. How'd you do that? What foul magic was that? Blood and desire in equal measure. An art I learned from... elsewhere. Blood magic, then? Yes, Monsieur. Please don't kill me. Tell me everything now! You're going to answer all my questions, and if there's even a hint of magic. Tirani put me here, to send biddable Templar recruits to the Sanctuary. Three Spear Alley in the Undercity. I enchanted Wilmot and Keren weeks ago. But after they left these walls, I know not what came of them. Please, let me live. It's not my fault. It was all Tarani's idea. Tarani? Tell me about Tarani. She put me up to this. She said we can recreate the ancient Imperium. That mages can rule again, not serve. She says the Templars cannot hold against us if I we stand really up and fight. really changed my staff. I <laughs> really should. Oh, tell me about the sanctuary. This base of yours. How many other mages are there? Any other defenses? People go in and out all the time. Sometimes a handful, sometimes more. There are traps. Magical traps. There's a hidden switch at the front. It turns them off. That, that's all I know. Hmm. You go to the Templars. The Templars are coming for you. No more of your tricks. We need to go to the Sanctuary. Some blood mage bitch needs to pay for this. Oh. Uh, rivalry. Uh, whatever. I'm not even interested in her anyway. I keep you around simply because... Well, I kind of need a rogue. But I can replace you with Varric if I have to, so keep that in mind. And let me tell you, he's nicer. Okay, gather your party and go venture forth. Okay. I guess we're going to Dark Town. I've been questing for how many hours now? This, this. I really don't want to try to speed run my way through this game, to be honest. Just. No, 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 no. Save game. All right, sanctuary. Let's go. Really. We're going to just waltz in here and fight dozens of blood mages. Ourselves? Yes. Alright, I'm game. Alright, well I'm glad that you're on board with it. This is pretty cool. She, just, she said there's a switch at the front. Whoa, 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 ho, ho. Let's get rid of that trap there. Isabel, attack, would you? Thank you. Brook and Stern, come out. Ooh, okay. Now I need healing. And I need healing. I better have a lot of these. Okay, you are a dick. I need to die. Help! Okay, tank for me, please. Rage demon. Mine. Crate. Mine. Ooh, rune of frost warding. <gasps> Mushroom! It's a death root, actually, so... Whatever, it's... It's a new... It's another... So you do actually have to do the side quests, so that, that way they can lead you all around and give you all this... Ooh. The veil. And give you all kinds of, you know, crafting recipes that... Alright. Go chew on them, Borkenster. Maybe I'm just being incredibly inefficient. Okay, you're, you're dying. 
Yeah, I need to get better creation magics for healing because I can't. Ooh, corpse. Mine. Gimme. Man, they really got blood mages around here. Hmm. Okay. Isabella, can you go first? I kind of need you to scout and search for traps here. Cause, oh, yeah, there we go. Blow him up. Good boy, Borkenstern. You chew on those bones. I know how much you love bones. And chewing on them. What? Heal? And go back to killing him. Corpse. Mine. So, from what I heard in Dragon Age Inquisition, apparently the crafting system just completely... Well, it negates the need to ever loot or do much of anything. Tread Wait a minute. Mm-hmm. Yep. You happy now? No. Because you asked if I was happy now. Me? Happy? <laughs> Please. Aveline, why are you running ahead? Stop it. What is this? Hello? How wonderful. More vessels for our experiments. Where is Karen? Perhaps the demons will find one of you suitable. This demon worship thing is a real turn-off. No kidding. I am not some hopeless waif that ran crying to a demon. I sought them out and embraced them. So, what are you doing here? Why have you taken the recruits? Demons can inhabit much more than mages and corpses. With assistance, they can control anyone I ask. Any Templar. Any noble. Any well-meaning meddler. I'm not gonna lie, I like the shade of white lipstick on her. I'm not- I'm no easy prey. You do know I cut a path through your abominations, right? Good, good! The demons like spirit. If a few more Templars fall to the demons, we can seed chaos in their ranks. How many abominations can they discover amongst their own before it drives the Knight Commander crazy? Where are the recruits? Tell me where Karen is. The experiments need so much fuel, you see. So many living vessels are found wanting. Useless vessels can still feed the compost heap, so it's not a complete waste. Your plan is insane. Good to know you're barking mad. That makes things easier. In days of old, the Tevinter Imperium spanned the known world. Demons were their allies, held in check by power and knowledge. With a wave of a hand, I could do more than a Templar can achieve in a lifetime. Yet they command us. Absurd. We should be ruling them. We should rule you all. Kill the vessels only if you must. Good. Yeah, please try to. Okay. No. Let's just do this. What the? Yes, do that. Borkenstern, you got mages to chew on. Get the abominations. Get these ones over here as well. Oh, she's, she's about to die. Oof. That was close. Probably one of the least careful mages and healers in the world. Wow. There we go. Only silver. Oh, I'll get to you in a moment. Let's see. Take that, take that, take that, and take that. There we go. Hey, Karen. What's going on, man? Is it... Is it over? 
Kind of. Karen. Yes, that's my name. Oh, thank the Maker. I thought he had abandoned me. So, when do we find out if this one's got a demon inside? The cage has opened. Thank Andraste. Is he possessed, Meryl? Meryl, you know something about this. Is he possessed? I don't know. It's... It's clean. There's no scent of demons in his blood. Uh, you can leave. Go ahead and leave, Karen. You've been through enough. Don't tell the Templars. I... I don't know what they do to me. Please. I need to go back. Tell them I'm alright. Tell my sister. I... I must go. Cullen needs to hear about this mess. Okay. Let's go tell him then. Well, I guess for now we're going back into Darktown. Ferelden's free marchers, all shims are the same down here. Oh, 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 okay. All shims are the same down here? Doesn't sound a little racist to you? Oh. Honestly. Oh. Oh. Offended I am. Oh. Hey man, night captain. I've got some good news and some bad news. What? What is it? Good news, Karen is safe. Bad news, half of your recruits may have been possessed by demons. Sweet blood of Andraste. De demons? Did you say something about the recruits and demons? I didn't want to tell you, Masha. They... they were horrible. Those mages see the rest of us as ants to be crushed. They won't stop until they've destroyed the Chantry and the Templars forever. I mean, hey, I'm a mage. Not all mages are like that. True, not every mage gives in to temptation, but none are ever free of it. Humans At do- any time, any mage could become a monster. From the lowest apprentice to the most seasoned enchanters. Mages cannot be treated like people. They are not like you and me. Surely that's a little harsh. They are weapons. They have the power to light a city on fire in a fit of pique. You're wrong. Mages are humans and elves, just like the rest of us. Many might go their whole lives thinking that. But if even one in ten falls to the lure of blood magic, they could destroy this world. For now, Karen, unless it is proven you are free of demons, I must strip you of your commission immediately. No, you can't really think that. Karen's fine. He's safe. Please, sir. I tried to resist. I never took anything they offered. I... I need this position or my sister can't eat. I've been training for five years. Karen's fine. We conducted tests on Karen. He's not possessed. He can stay in the order. I hesitate to ask what methods you used that you are so certain. Still, you have done much for us by stopping these blood mages. I will heed your request. If he has shown no sign of demonic possession in ten years' time, Karen will become eligible for full knighthood. Thank you, Sarah. Again. But without a full knighthood, Karen's pay is so small. I do not know if I can reward you as you deserve. I will handle that, miss. You have done the Order a great service. We will not forget it. Cool. Meryl friendship plus 20? Wow. Receive four gold. I wonder, what's her friendship with me like now? Woo. Look at that. It, it was all right. I mean, it was way down here. Now it's way up here. Meryl. We're going to be more than friends in no time. Let me tell you, Meryl. Mm-hmm. Uh, the Deep Roads Expedition, um, duty, what is duty? 